guys, welcome back to our channel. It's Viv from Pete and Viv Vlogs. Hope you are all well. Thank you guys for joining in for another session of our vlogs. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. My name is Viv, the other half of Pete and Viv Vlogs. Pete is my husband and we like to share our lives um, on a regular, well, on a weekly basis. We do that on here uh, on Pete and Viv Vlogs. So we do ministry, we do uh, fun and games. We've got children and just family and different discussions so hope you enjoy please like share subscribe would like to hear what you enjoyed in the comments down below and yeah so hope you enjoy our vlog today so this week started out beautifully the weather was amazing and we were just setting ourselves up that okay spring is just coming out we're getting ready for summer the warm weather is coming so many plans for the weekend but look outside right now can you see that? It's been raining. Not only raining today, but it's been raining for the last three days. So we just had one day, basically, of sun teasing us. So hope you enjoy our vlog for everyone out there. We just love you and we appreciate that you stopped on by today. Enjoy and see you soon. Here we are with um, Mr. and Mrs. M. They've asked us to vlog them. Ready? I'm not turning around. <laughs> Maybe you better switch that camera off. So, Mr. and Mrs. N uh, with their sister in law. <laughs> Time to do some exercise with the family. <laughs> Lovely day. Summer's back. Or well, summer's almost here. On, this is our local park. Or one of our local parks. Lovely, lovely, lovely place.
Shima Ume Nana Ume Ready to let me go there. Yes, well, I mean, or well, give me your trousers then. <laughs> You're out in the wilderness, and survival is all you need. To survive, you have to think outside the box. Survival is what you need to survive. Survival is all you need to survive. You take your children's clothes. Wrap them around your legs and enter the wilderness. What if there are snakes in here? Woo. Vivian's actually got trousers on. Can you show them the trousers you have? And you're letting me go in every show. I don't shows. have thousands, I have sure. <laughs> But you're the man of the family. You have to protect us. Levi, that's a stinging net on the floor, my love. Yeah, yeah I know that. Behind Ow! you, darling. Levi. Levi. Yeah. He made something out of his own mind. He's looking for every animal. Oh, no. Survive. Thanks for your help. Bye. We done. And that's how you do it. That's how you wear out two energetic boys. We done. I'm done. I'm going back to the office today. I'm not ready. I have mixed emotions. I don't know how to feel about that, but let's see how it goes. Wednesday morning and our kid is going back to work in the office. It's a bit of a strange one, isn't it? Getting ready, going back to the office. And dolling herself up. Why don't you doll yourself up when you're working from home? I don't doll myself, I'm just combing my hair. Hmm? Why don't you comb your hair when you're working from home? Wow. <laughs> Go away. How do you feel about going back to work? I don't know. I don't know. I've got mixed emotions, I said earlier. I'm just not 100% about it to be honest, but it's something new that I've introduced. Let's see how it goes. But anyway, you did used to go to the office. I know that's what everyone is saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just used to being it's, back. It's not like at you home. haven't been to your office. I think some people probably are loving going back to the office. People who love the social aspect, but I think Vivian was quite happy working from home. Yeah. <sighs> Bye. Bye. Have a great day. Love you. Bye. Bye. We're picking up Vivian from work. It is our first day back to the, in the office after our lockdown. Mom's. Hey? Mom's not our no, did I say our first day? Yes. I meant mummy. Our mom's, our mom's coming. I think. Yes, yes, it's her. It is her. She's coming. She's here. Hello. Hello there, mommy. Hello, mom. Mommy, 
Yeah. There she is. Oh my day. The beauty of the family. I thought I'm the beauty of the family. Good there. The head of the family. <laughs> That's what you are. I the beauty. Mummy's the beauty of the family. And Hello, beauty of the family. Oh, hey guys. Hello. It was good. Freezing, but good. Yeah, it was good. Did it's you enjoy being enough. back in the office? Um, yeah, actually, it was not too bad. I felt more. Yeah, but it was busy. Just went yeah, in, just happy, busy, 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 non-stop. When the kids came friends. back, when the kids came back from. School they were like, oh, we miss mommy being here. We oh, used to be mommy being here. Oh, boys, really? Oh, yeah. I missed you too. Yeah, I really did. I just miss seeing you guys coming in, making us too. all your chit chat. Chit chat, yeah. Your little chit -chat. chatter, chatter. Yeah, we chatter, chatter a lot. Yeah. Brown yeah. 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 favorite piece of the time, carrying Brown. Oh hey guys, today we have a songwriting session with Fountain Church and uh, I'm here at the church getting ready for our songwriting session and hopefully it will be a nice one so we'll keep vlogging for you and you can have a look at some of the things that we do here as we write songs as you can see we've got the place set up a little bit different People are in the room already, getting ready, you've got all the musicians, all the singers in, so, yeah. So uh, everyone's just trickling in one by one, Ben just showed up, we have Pastor Pete the businessman, very important. We have Lady Brianna over here, looking all styled out, I see the swag, I see the swag. We have the young Tamara here, <laughs> birthday the other day. Oh yeah, it's Brianna's birthday tomorrow. Nash, what did that tell you? <laughs> That young Izzy, yeah, just my boy right there. We have Auntie Sharma over here. We have Uncle Caution over here. We have Tad over there. We have Young Emmanuel. You know the vibes, man. You know the vibes. You know the vibes. So many. What we doing today, bro? Huh? We songwriting, bro. We songwriting. We songwriting. We writing a song. We writing an album. You feel me? You write album. Okay, okay, tell me more, tell me more, tell me more. Yeah, you know that, uh, you know, it's gonna be uh, vibes mm. and uh, small vibes. Mm. Spiritual. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Um, yeah. Yeah, they yeah. should look forward to it, shouldn't they? Absolutely. It's gonna be tantalizing. Tantalizing. Tantal Sensation. Sensational. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right, here, I'm wondering what, what this is. This is the Fountain Merch. As you can see, we saw 2021. We have Isaiah 4031 at the back there. Guys, get your merch, get your merch, get your merch. I can't express that enough. All right, all right, all right. It is sound, It is sound. Mr. Debra, Debra is um, a center out to get some. some Feed some, eat some snacks. Yes, sir. So we're doing a songwriting session. Mm -hmm. uh, are you looking forward to it? I mean, I'm just gonna be in the back. I'm hearing you have a few lines. I don't have any lines. Do you want to show the camera a I few lines? I know lines. you write some gospel rap, bro. I know you have some gospel no, we're rap. Trying to keep, we we're trying to bring people to Christ, not turn them away. So. What? <laughs> gospel rap is okay, no? No, I mean, I'm, I'm talking oh, about. Oh, ye. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay for us to sing songs that. Maverick has written songs that um, Hillsong has written, that Minister Mainde, Ma, Mainde has written, Jesus. and all that. But I believe that every fellowship is unique. God is doing something unique in our fellowship and in our families. And thus, as, a, as worship leaders, one of the jobs that God has given us is to lead people into relevant worship. You know, when we write a song that is relevant to what we're going through as a, as a fellowship, there's a different anointing that comes with that song. Mm -hmm. We need to write about our experience as a fellowship, as families, as a church, with the word that the Lord is giving us for the season. We've got to write prophetic songs, songs that are speaking what we want to see happening in our lives. Well, it's history. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
here and there, just a few. Okay, good. One so one. you will share with us your writing process. Well, that can show for as well. <laughs> <laughs> but it's there, it's there. Yeah, but it's there. Yeah. Yeah. Did you put your hand up? Yeah. <laughs> but if you see, have you written? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, no, she gave me a mic stand. But, uh, uh, what? Uh, and I'll put the bass on the kitchen I'll be in my room and my voice my phone recorder on my phone has got so many songs that just come washing up it will just come and I quickly catch it and I press record you just download and I just started to write it down and I got the melody came and that came about music so I can sometimes do it when I hear the music and it just I'm humming along I'm singing along and then it just comes or I'll just be in a time of worship I get a lot of my sermons a lot of my songs and you have, like Deborah says, a minute, mm. and they start fading away. Mm. They start fading away. You have to be ready to, to literally just hum it in the middle of the night. Mm. Mm. Me and Michael <laughs> were pulling up the car and saying, and your children. I was like, oh, Pastor Pete, that's an amazing song, right? <laughs> I downloaded it off YouTube, and I recorded it on YouTube. I sent it to Femi, my friend, and I said, oh, look, this new song my pastor made up here. Can you That's it? too <laughs> funny. <laughs> <laughs> I People like, oh, think that the pastor is stealing songs. Tell it, Jess. Yeah, we'll hear it today. Yeah. This musician team. Can we put everyone too much? We'll hear it today. No chance. Oh, 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 Ben's actually got up, normal. Yeah, he's yeah, actually yeah, got yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's actually stood up for you yeah. to sit down yeah. on the piano oh. and play it. Oh. Okay, let me try to remember it. Let me try to remember it. <laughs> 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 Do you know what you're doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 That is from the, the new living in the King James Church. <laughs> I, I, can, I will share. Exposing your songs. I will share. I will share my song. He was left. Time this song. <laughs> that was his rap song. That wasn't his, his song. song. He was left. Peter has a rap song. Pastor mm. Peter has a rap song. Don't put it as if he was not a banger. That's what I saw his rap. Hang on. I don't wanna. Uh, uh, na, 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 na. Does anyone know whether he released a song? 
find it anywhere. It's just one clip on YouTube. <laughs> no, but I played that song before. I think we had a lot of young people. And I had to stop and think, oh, I hope I'm not instigating something here, which is because the way they started moving. I was like, start saying gun fingers. <laughs> yeah, you still do it. You don't worry, I do it too. And for some reason, everyone else follows you. They're all like, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. All these years, no one has told me. Have you done time? Have you done time? No, no, no country has it much. Waiting upon the Lord, mounting or soaring on wings like eagles. So Ben, just give us that, give us that. And everyone, just begin. Let's go. The chorus for this, I'm feeling it almost like the beginning. basically summarize that verse without the verse yeah so Isaiah 40 verse 31 says but those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength so could you go from the, the third the third bit Thank you. 